Hi there, Coach here. In this video we're going to talk about proper placement and securing of shoulder pads. This is a video that's worth watching for players and your coaches and your parents. Now, your shoulder pads have already been fitted properly by your equipment manager to make sure that you got the proper fit, but I'm just going to show you a couple pointers here. This happens to be a set where we've got two sets of straps. Many sets have one, that's fine. So shoulder pads secure both through the straps and then through the lace at the front. Now an important thing with the lacing of the front is we want to make sure we're tight here and oftentimes we have this slider. This slider however is not a substitute for properly securing the shoulder pads. It's important to also tie uh, a knot into this otherwise you risk with contact of the game these shoulder pads coming loose and when they do they are more likely to move around. Loose shoulder pads run the risk of jamming into the player's neck and giving them a bit of a burner. So we make sure it's tight, we secure it, and then just fasten a simple bowl. Players and parents, make sure that you are getting that properly secured before you begin contact in your practices and your games. And coaches, keep an eye out for this as your contact goes on during a practice, making sure that this has not come undone and the shoulder pads are fitting loose. Likewise, you want to make sure that you've got a snug fit in here, that these are not overly loose, and you may want to even consider taping them up to help secure that fit. Likewise, you also want to be sure, in this particular case, these are secured to the back already, but sometimes you'll find in uh, buckles on the back as well, and you want to make sure those are secured. I've seen many times uh, over my years playing and coaching the sport, these buckles found loose on the field. That's obviously a sign that they weren't properly secured beforehand. Okay, two additional pointers about shoulder pads to make your life in football a little bit easier. One is that it's very difficult for a player to put on their own jersey once they have their shoulder pads on. So a nifty little trick that veterans will often teach you is you put the jersey on over your shoulder pads first and then you simply pop the entire setup over your head, secure your buckles and your lace and you're ready to go. The other trick is at the end of your practice or your games, simple way for transporting this stuff. You stick your helmet up underneath your shoulder pads, through your jersey, and you simply use your face mask as a carrying handle. And that way you'll be able to get all of your stuff cleanly to and from the field. 